So first thing we're going to do is remove all of the workstations so that we can get them linked properly from scratch. This is probably a better solution. Start by breaking every single workstation. It's nice that they're not linked. It's worse when they're linked. Uh, break them all. And then we can use just farmers for finding that yellow hat. We don't have to keep... Alrighty. You dumb cat. <laughs> oh, the zombies are spawning because it's night. Okay. There we go. And this and this. All workstations up. So now we're going to put down one composter. Oh, he grabbed it right here. So this guy's right here. We're going to put this on the left side of him. He is linked. He's done. Oh, but wait. Let's use a different workstation. Let's use a blast furnace. Because they look a lot different. So a blast furnace is a linked villager. Okay. A composter. Oh. Who took it? Let's see. We're looking for a yellow hat. There he is. A light above his head. Break the composter. And then we're going to put a blast furnace there. Done. Okay. So we're going to repeat this cycle. Right here. Nice. Right beside Mr. Blast Furnace. Nice. Woo! Oh, it's so nice when they're close to each other. It's so much less work. Oh, right there. Beautiful. Okay, this is going a lot easier than it normally would. Oh man, it's like they're skipping one. Something about the way that they connected to their beds is making this so easy. Oh, around the corner here. It's never this easy, so... Oh. I mean, unless, unless um, these villagers are just linked a lot better than what I usually do. Who took it? Oh, right around the corner. Here. We're going to have this fixed up in no time. I don't see him. Right here. Too easy. Okay, let's see who's next. Oh, right over here. There you are. Grab that before I put this down. If you if you move a little too fast, sometimes you'll get the villager grabbing that composter again. Okay, let's see here. Where is our farmer? Right here. Normally I have trap doors in front of the villagers, and I just drop the trap door that's in front of the villager that needs the, the new workstation. But this, uh, this cube doesn't have the trap doors yet, and I don't want to add anything else besides getting the golem spawning. Just so that we don't confuse trap doors with golem spawning. Alright, right here. And this should be the fix, always. This should always be the fix for this base. And I hope it works even though I didn't break the beds. Normally I would break the beds and place those down, but that's... Uh, really you should, because we, we may have to in the end. Um, because if the center of your village is off, that's how you fix that, is by breaking the beds and putting them back down. Uh, who took this? Looking for that yellow hat. Right here. Good. By the time we get to three quarters, we will be, should be getting golems. Okay. I don't know why or how those cats on the outside, but they are right here. Oh. 
This process I've done for a few different viewers of mine. Um, so I'm kind of glad I can just record this and and have this information so that I can have this. I'll, I'll probably put this on YouTube and just use it as a link video for anybody who's troubleshooting their cubes. All right. Right here. Oh, where were we? So we're looking for the next farmer right here. I don't even know if I really need to. I could probably remember that, but whatever. Yeah. Nice. Let's see here. Oh, that's not him. Yellow hat, yellow hat, right here. And this is how I would normally um, start Zap's Magic Cube, is I would get all the villagers in place and then do this all the way around. I've only really ever had to do it once per cube, but if something wonky happens with your beds and your villagers aren't linking properly, then you'll have to do this again, which, you know, it's, it's not the end of the world. Uh, where is this guy? Right here. Oopsie. <laughs> this guy. It's, uh, oh, you know what? It's kind of nice, because they, um, all right, let's do this. They don't have a profession, whereas everyone else is a book person. So as soon as they link, I could probably just break it. Which, I don't know if this is a normal, all right, let's see. Oh, right here. Yeah, the guy without the profession. Nice. I don't even need that glow block. I think I saw him back here. Guy without a profession. Guy without a profession. Right here. No. That didn't work. Interesting. Oh, because there's two guys without professions. I wonder... Anyway. I see him right there. Okay. It's already grabbed. Let's break this. Oh, right here. Yep. What is that thing? Wait, oh no. Let's have a look, see. Who's got a yellow hat? Hey! Right here. <laughs> ah! I had a spyglass that would work too. We could spyglass through everything, find the person. Oh, I broke it. So it could be this guy. No. Oh, right around the corner here. Okay, I feel like we gotta be getting close here. I think I saw him right there. You? Oh, over there. This is one reason why I like building these out of glass. Oh, although it doesn't quite work if you're trying to get golems to spawn. Because if you have light in here, it's going to affect that spawner. But I think, I think it could work. And here we see the farm is functioning. We are getting golems, zombies. Everything is working perfectly. And this will fix it 99% of the time, just reset all of the villagers' workstations back in front of them.